What's going on guys, welcome to my tutorial in Adobe Premiere Pro CS5. In this video I'm going to show you how to add an audio effect in your project and it's very simple to do. On the left hand side here we have audio effects and I'm going to select the reverb under stereo and all you have to do is bring it out onto your audio track. Up here in the effect controls panel I have the reverb option and what happens is, is that you can adjust this where you don't have to have the effect control the whole track. So over here what I can do is I can apply a keyframe um, and we can control this. So what I want to do is take um, just the level by clicking this little time clock. We've gone over this before with keyframes in my other tutorials. But in this situation what's going to happen is I'm going to bring this out over here. I'm going to add another keyframe because I want it to keep going. Now while I have this keyframe adjusted I can continue on and play with the settings here. Not that I need to really, but if you wanted to, you can do that. And that's why you have keyframes. You're trying to adjust each period of time that you want a change in the effect. And then I'm gonna come over here and I'm gonna select bypass. And the bypass is gonna allow me to actually turn this effect off. So I'm gonna come back here. I'm gonna play this and then right away after this keyframe. And I can extend this keyframe if I want to to take the effect away. Let's do that one more time. I don't know if you guys can notice on your end, but what happened was over here we have the effect that's controlled and I'm going to turn this um, audio off so it doesn't annoy you guys. So we have the keyframe over here. I made a little bit of an adjustment over here with the effect but it still went on and then in the third keyframe this is the bypass Premiere Pro tells the effect to turn off and then we continue on I can uh, add another keyframe and click that off and then it'll turn it back on so let's try that out effect is on effect is off and then effect goes back on so that's it, that's how you add an effect to your audio track in Adobe Premiere Pro CS5. I hope you guys enjoyed the tutorial, and I'll see you guys later. Cheers.